Hey guys, it's Heidi. Welcome back to my channel. And yeah, mm. nice and cool today. Anyway, um, so yeah, I've recently did a video on my other channel about being disheartened, and just something that had happened, and I kind of got upset about it. And when Mom asked me, "Were your friends?" Mm. I didn't know what to say to her. Anyway. Yeah. So, yeah. Anyway. So, God, I've been asking God, Lord, what is it that you want me to do? You created me to do something. What is it? And this morning's reading um, comes from Matthew chapter 20, verse 26 to 28. And also Luke 22, verse 27. You guys can actually go and read that. Right, in Matthew, it's basically um, what it led up to that scripture was, whoever wants to be become great among you must be your servant, and whoever wants to be first must be your slave. Just as the Son of Man did not come to be served, but to serve. And... Um, Sorry, let me just turn the sound off, otherwise it's going to keep making a noise. Um, yeah. Basically, in a nutshell, I'm not going to read this whole thing. Basically, in a nutshell, I have been doing what God has called me to do. I've not realized it. <laughs> in order for us to serve God, we need to serve people. Right? Because we're serving the Lord by serving others. And when we do so, we need to do so with a cheerful heart and not moan and groan and complain about it. So just know that you will be there for others. And others won't always be there for you. Yeah, so that's when we rely on the Lord and say, Lord, please help. Anyway. So basically... We need to just serve one another and regard others as higher than ourselves. I don't look down on people because I don't think anybody is beneath me. If anything, I am the one that's at the bottom looking up and looking up to people. I've always been that way. I don't know. I've always been comfortable in the kitchen. You know, I'd rather go and wash somebody's dishes than sit and talk to them at the table. <laughs> I'd rather get up and go and wash their dishes. That is what I enjoy doing. It's like, okay, my hands are busy. The Lord is talking to me. And, yeah. yeah. So apparently I have been doing all along what God has called me to do. And, yeah, sometimes God does allow things in our lives to get us to go, um, to move us in the direction he wants us to go. Because sometimes we get very comfortable. So, uh, I'm very comfortable sitting here. Do I really need to get, you know what? <laughs> God will make you very uncomfortable in order to get you to go where he wants you to go. Yeah. So, yeah, God knows my heart is on the road, and I'd love to be out there on the road. But in the meantime, I have to just do short trips, maybe overnight, one day, two, two days, three days, whatever. Um, yeah. And yes, God is quite capable of joining my love for travel and serving people. I'm sure he can combine the two. And yeah, anyway, and that being said, that being said, God has asked me to take a break from the mission trips this year. I need to step back. And whether it's all of them or just one or two of them, I don't know. I just, I think it's, I've got an idea it's for the whole year that I need to step back from all of them this year. So, yeah, um, I'm quite 
happy to do so because I know it's the Lord that's asking me to do this. And yeah, when God asks us to do something, we need to do it because, yeah, it's just better that way. Better that we listen because obedience is better than sacrifice. Yeah, so we minister to God by ministering to others. We serve God by serving others. You can just look and see what Jesus did. Look and see what Paul did. I mean, Paul lived to serve people and well, serve the Lord by serving others. Um, yeah. So we need to um, copy Christ. We need to follow his example. Yeah. I actually prefer that people don't know what it is that I do for others and everything that I do do. I, I prefer that people don't know that. It's just who I am. You get other people that they'd love to say, oh, I went and I bought clothes for my mom or my mother-in-law, and I went and had her hair cut, and I took her to lunch, and I did this for this one, and I did that for that one, and you remember all the things I've given you, and bloody blah fish post. People thrive on that, some people. But behind the scenes, there's, some, there's another spirit operating there which is not nice. Me personally, I don't want people to know what I do for other people. It's got nothing to do with anybody else. And, yeah. Anyway. So that is life. So apparently I have been doing all along what God has asked me to do. And it is very easy, very simple, nothing difficult. Just remember, whatever God calls you to do, Is normally pretty easy. You know, very simple. Might not be easy, but it's very simple. There's a difference. Difference between easy and simple, difference between fact and truth. So, yeah. Simple is, yeah, there is a difference between simple and easy. <laughs> The fact is, when somebody makes you very angry, go bake them a cake. Give it to them. Or if somebody's been nasty to you, be nice to them. Very simple. Be nice. Is it easy? Not so much. Because I would probably trip and fall over something and let them have the cake. Let them wear it, rather. So, yeah. <laughs> and then fact and, and truth. Uh, facts change, truth doesn't. Anyway. anyway, guys, I hope you can make sense of this. And what this woman had written at the end of this thing is, I want, I want in the short life of mine as much as can be pressed of service, truth for God and man. Help me to do my best. There's also that Chinese, I think it's a Chinese saying. I don't know, it's a saying come from somewhere. And it says, I shall pass through this life but once. Therefore, any good that I can do, let me do it now. For I shall not pass this way again. Something like that. And those are things that I've always followed. But sometimes, yeah, sometimes life gets to us, eh? Anyway. Yeah, you can see I love traveling. I even covered my book with a map. <laughs> anyway, guys, lots and lots of love. Hope you can make sense of this. Lord Jesus loves you. Bye.